welcome back everyone so today in this video i will be helping you to fix 100 percent disk usage on your windows 10 and windows 11. now on my computer you can see that my disk usage is zero percent and even the cpu and the memory usage they are fluctuating it's high but the disk usage you know it's around zero and one percent only that is because i have done all the optimization and that optimization you also need to apply on your computer so without any delay let's quickly get started and make sure guys you hit the like and subscribe to the channel so that more people can reach this video first you have to click on your windows search type cmd right click on the command prompt click run as admin click on yes in the black window you have to run few command all these commands you will find in the description so the first one will be chk dsk space c colon sign give a space forward slash scan hit the enter key so now this will be scanning and it may take some time so you will have to wait here once it will be done the next command will be chk dsk space c colon space forward slash f again hit the enter key and now this can start the scanning and sometime it can give you a message that the next time the system restart okay so we press y key and the next time when you will start the computer it will automatically check your disk okay so kindly go with the y option and now we can close it next click on your windows search type services hit the enter key in the services we have to disable few services like sysmain so you can scroll down to the s section until you find the sysmain once you get it double click on it and here first you have to click on the stop then from the startup type drop down choose disabled click on apply and then click on ok the next one is connected device platform so come to the c section and then you have to look for connected devices platform services again double click on it stop the service then click on the startup drop down and choose it to disabled click on apply click on ok now as of now i am only disabling two services but in case still you don't find the much difference then you can also disable the windows search so come to the w section and somewhere you will find windows search once you get it double click on it and do the same stop it and from the drop down choose disabled now this is only when you don't find the difference after disabling the first two services all right so once you are done you can close it now next bring up your file explorer click on this pc from the left hand side right click on the local disk c then click on properties in the properties from the top menu option click on tools then in the optimize and defragment drive you have to click on optimize then below you'll find schedule optimization and on the right hand side click on change settings and here you have to disable this run on a schedule recommended okay this is only for the optimization but it run in the background which you can manually do whenever you want to optimize it okay uncheck this option click on ok and then click on close click ok and close everything next right click on the windows icon click on task manager now here from the top menu option you have to click on startup and here you have to look for all kind of application the third party application that you have manually installed application like microsoft edge onedrive steam discord skype that you can manually open it and you don't need that it should come along with the computer okay so look for all these application disable it now don't disable any kind of audio file wi-fi or any kind of antivirus file once you are done you can close it and now you also need to uninstall the unwanted application that you are not using anymore so click on your windows search type app wiz.cpl hit the enter key now this will list you all kind of application program that you have installed on your computer now many time you install some application for a while and then you don't use in the future so look here for any application for any kind of toolbar that you don't identify or you don't use it 
just make a right click on it and choose uninstall in case if you are confused with any of the application or program then you can type that name in the google and you will let to know that what kind of application that is used for okay so finally we are remaining with the final step now you have to make a right click on the windows icon then click on settings and here you have to click on system then from the left hand menu option you have to click on storage and now here it will be calculating that what kind of space has been occupied by different categories so here you have to look for the temporary file click on it now this might list you all kind of categories like recycle bin download folder any kind of windows old folder so if you don't need the item in the recycle bin in the download then you can check them but if you need you can uncheck it the rest you check all of them then you have to click on remove file once it's been done you can close it then make a right click on the windows icon click on run type temp hit the enter key select all press shift delete key to delete them all again right click on the windows icon click on run type percent temp percent click on ok press ctrl a to select all then press the shift and the delete key to delete them all check the box click on skip continue all right so you are all done and now you have to simply restart the computer and the next time when you will check the disk usage on your task manager you will find that disk usage has been reduced but in case still if you don't find much uh, differences then finally you will have to disable your antivirus it can be your windows security or it can be any kind of third party security whichever you're using it's all up to you it's optional if you want to really uh, reduce the disk usage then you can go with this option as well so that's all guys for today hopefully you found this video helpful and if yes do not forget to like and subscribe and i see you in the next video Bye bye